Have you ever thought about why some people don't see beatboxing as a real music? Today we will explore the reasons behind this and show you why beatboxing really deserves place in the music world. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we are diving into a unique topic. Why do some people not view beatboxing as a music? Stick around to find out because by the end, I think your perspective might just change. First, let's clarify what beatboxing actually is. Beatboxing is a form of vocal percussion that involves creating rhythms, beat, and variety of the sounds. And of course, using only a human voice. One major reason why people may dismiss beatboxing is the option of traditional instruments. A lot of people believe that real music has to involve guitars, drums, or keyboards, creating a narrow view of what music can be. The educational gap. Not everyone understands the skill and technicality. This lack of knowledge can lead to the undervaluation of its complexity. It's like watching a magician perform. You might not appreciate the craft unless you know how it's done. Okay, now let's talk about the creativity. Beatboxing is an incredible outlet for artistic expression. It's about crafting intricate soundscapes and telling stories through beats, which can evoke emotions just like any traditional musical performance. Beatboxing is a blend of skill that worthy of applause. Beatboxing in mainstream culture. Recently, beatboxing has made a splash in mainstream media. Like music videos or talent shows, artists' collaboration with beatboxers are helping to bridge the gap and bring this unique art form to more audience. Now, the competitions. Competition like the Grand Beatbox Battle, I think any beatboxer know it. It has been phenomenal in showcasing amazing talents and drawing more attention to the art form. These events have really highlighted the incredible skills of beatboxers around the world. The quantity over quality. Platforms like TikTok, YouTube Shorts, or Instagram Reels. The new creators rush to produce content to join trends without taking the time to learn the basics of beatboxing, resulting in a surge of low effort material. When less experienced creators post videos that don't reflect beatboxing, it can misrepresent the skill involved. Viewers might think that all beatboxing sounds like those quick TikTok clips and basics, when in reality there is so much more depth to it. The failure to showcase the powerful and intricate nature of beatboxing means that many viewers might not appreciate the real talent behind the art. Some people might argue that beatboxing lacks the harmonic or melodic complexity found in traditional instruments, while beatboxing can represent a full range of sounds. For those who haven't engaged with beatboxing deeply, it might be seen as simply rhythmic vocal sounds without an appreciation for the skill involved. Many might not fully understand the creativity, effort, and practice that goes into mastering beatboxing. I mean guys, for me, it's like take me 6 years to be professional beatboxer. Negative stereotypes. Some people may hold misconceptions or negative stereotypes about beatboxing, associating it with non seriousness or gimmicky performance rather than recognizing it as a legitimate art form. While beatboxing is an incredible and dynamic form of music expression, not everyone will resonate with beatboxing due to culture backgrounds, personal preferences, or misconception about the art form. Beatboxing is not just for hip hop. One big misperception is that beatbox is only for hip hop. In reality, beatboxing can blend into a variety of music genres. From pop to jazz to electronic music, beatboxing has something to offer across the music spectrum. It's important to remember that mastering beatboxing takes time and dedication. Many famous beatboxers start as beginners. This journey of growth can be inspiring and highlight the artistry involved. Now, the future of beatboxing. Now, beatboxing is on the rise, with social media platforms enabling artists to share their talent. More and more people are beginning to appreciate this incredible form of expression. Guys, if you're not familiar with beatboxing or haven't given it a chance, I wholeheartedly encourage you to explore it. Check out some amazing beatboxers on YouTube or catch a live show. Believe me, it's an experience you won't forget. So guys, my thought on this topic, I think there are some people don't like beatboxing because that short video you find it anywhere i'm talking about tiktok and any shorts platform don't get me wrong it's cool to see all these beatboxers doing beatbox content but the problem is there are some people do so cringe beatbox and i'm not gonna say names don't worry 
I think that's what make people hate beatboxers because they all thought we do like same these guys ok guys now I will show you examples of best beatbox songs I have ever seen on my opinion I'm not gonna show you everything I'm just gonna show you short clips of the best ones ok begin with Tarastanen baby I don't give a damn no that's all inside I don't tell a lie Okay, now Improver Beatbox. Now Cutfish. Now King Inertia <laughs> And final one, Dilo. Hello, señorita, would you like a burrito? There are so many amazing beatboxers on the world, but this is just examples. I'm not gonna show you more because I wanna avoid the copyright, you know. So here's the question. Why might some people overlook beatboxing? It often comes down to misconceptions, biases against vocal only music, and a lack of understanding regarding its artistic value. If you enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. And I would love to hear your thoughts on beatboxing on my comments. And don't forget to subscribe to more content like this. Now, go subscribe. I can't wait to see you next time. Keep listening and keep exploring all the amazing forms beatbox can take. Bye.